guys, this is Renee. I'm here with my entry for Scrap from the Scratches, a masculine adult card challenge. And this is for her Mar her first March challenge. And this challenge, guys, it's open until March 13th, and the winner will be announced on the 14th. And for this card, you she wants you she doesn't want you to mail it in. Um, so check out her video. I will, um, I'm going to leave this as a video response. Um, and so, um, what the challenge is, is that you have to make an adult masculine card. It has to be A2 or bigger, which this one is. Um, it's, I'm just far away from it. It's, it's bigger. Um, then it had to be an outdoor theme and just slash animals because that's what her husband is into. He likes, you know, fishing and um, being outdoors, camping. Um, so this is what I did. Um, it's I'm going with the outdoor theme. So what this is, this is a watercolor painting that I made. Uh, I painted myself. And so that's pretty much what the card is. There's nothing on the inside, because what I'll do is um, I will put the sentiment on depending on who I'm giving the card to. Um, so what I did was I just, I did this watercolor painting. Um, uh, when what I used was my Stedler watercolor legs. And then for the trees, I used a bit of uh, Dollar Rowney, round, no, Sorry, Reeves. The other ones are <laughs> my acrylic paints. Um, so these are my watercolors. These are Reeves. Uh, on some of the trees here. To get a bit more uh, texture, I did it after. Um, so I just used some blues. Uh, a couple of different color blues for the water. A couple of different color greens. Some yellows, browns. Um, and then when I was done, you have to let the painting dry. Because if you put it on the cardstock right away, it's just going to completely warp your card. And even this one still, you can see it's still warped a little. So I'm going to leave this under a heavy book all night. And hopefully that will, uh... Oh my god, stop. <laughs> and hopefully that will straighten it back out. Um, and all I did was after it dried... Clearly I didn't leave it dry long enough... I mounted it on some brown um, cardstock from the dollar store. And then I just put it on this A2. Oh, sorry for the condition of my nails. They're filled with paint. Um, <laughs> uh, so, I just mounted it on this card from uh, the larger card you can buy from Michael's, the value packs. And that is my card, Sarah. I hope you like it. Um, yeah, and the best thing about doing a card like this, guys, is that they're really small. Uh, not small, but thin, and they're easy and cheap to mail. Plus, it's a little bit of artwork that you do for yourself, and um, I find people generally appreciate that. And I had a lot of fun doing it, actually, so this is all good. Alright, thank you so much, Sarah, for the challenge, and like I said, I hope you like my card, and I will uh, catch you later. I'm going to, I don't think I'll get the second one made tonight, but hopefully tomorrow so I can mail it off to you. I already have your address, so, uh, well, thanks guys for watching, and I will catch you later. Bye-bye.